I have a room with, like, viewing platforms, and then in the center, some stairs going down to what I'm going to call Dance Dance Revolution of Death. Can you get out, or do I need to draw the thing back? Uh, no, eyes out, eyes out. Oh, no. Oh, no! Oh, no! What's the matter, buddy? I have a room with, like, viewing platforms, and then in the center, some stairs going down to what I'm going to call Dance Dance Revolution of Death. Excellent! You're only saying that because it's not you. Can I cheat the system? I'm going to try and cheat the system. If you hear screaming and or if we get a game over, expect that. Well, hang on, because I've got like a courtyard here with uh, like a map. Right. Uh, it does look like a courtyard. At the other end of the Dance Dance Revolution is a castle. Yeah, yeah, that's what I've got here. Um, it doesn't show anything on there. I'm guessing there's got to be a lever somewhere. I had a door. Well, that's oh, nice. did I just open a door for you? Uh, I don't know, but as I walked up, I clicked it and it worked. So there's a creepy book. A creepy man? Uh, no, a book. It looks like some sort of, uh... Oh, um... Amber Adelaide Execution... Some, uh, Elite Logbook. And there's a lever. I've pulled the lever. Huh. I can't see anything that's happened over here. Hmm. So maybe we've got to do something with the logbook. Okay, I'm going to tell you what I've got in this room. So I've got, along the walls, I have some shields. They all have the same crest on them, which is a... Oh, no. It looks like a boar on its hind legs holding a sword. And the shields are orange. There is one red banner in here, which has, like, a wolf on its hind legs. <laughs> or it could be... It, that could actually be the lion from the last room. I just got a creepy laugh. Excellent. So I I had one lever that I could pull, and I did. And I've got a red lever that I can't pull. Okay, then. Alright, so I think I figured out what I have to do. I've also got three stained glass windows here. Yeah, so I've got six... And, uh, I can take the three pieces out of each, and, uh, behind the castle, I've got places to put those three pieces. Okay, so maybe that's what we need to do first. Alright, so first window, top night man guy. Yeah, night man guy with a helmet on. On mine, he is facing... My left, and he's wearing all grey armor. Is there anything on the armor? Yeah, yeah, there's like, uh, I, I think all the knights have the same insignias on their armor. Well, then how would I know which one to get? The insignias are gold, his armor's grey. And he's got like a panther head for a helmet? Yeah, yeah. There's three of those. Uh, green 
background with a yellow sun behind his head. Yeah, yeah, that's that's both. And he's got a big old bushy beard. Uh, how big old bushy beard? Eh, it's pretty big. Comes down to the bottom of the helmet. So I've got one that it looks like it goes all the way down his neck. On my one, you can see his neck. Well, you can see the grey of his armoured neck. Uh, I've got one that looks like the beard is basically just around his face. Yeah, I think that's the one. Let's hope you're right, Rob, because there was an evil thing here. Alright, uh, tragedy that goes with that one. Is that of a woman with, it looks like, a knife in her chest? Uh, there's a bunch of them. Is the woman, uh... What's she doing? Okay, so the woman's got, um, long red hair. It's in a braid. Um, she's wearing a grey or possibly blue dress. <coughs> with, like, white sleeves. She's wearing red lipstick. She's got like a really wrinkly neck. <laughs> um, and she's holding a dagger in her right hand. The dagger's got like a blue bottom to it. A jewel, like two jewels possibly in it. And it's got like red blood on the... Alright, I think I found it. What is the accent for that one? Uh, so right down at the bottom is, it's got like trees on the left and right and four white bushes with four red roses in them along the bottom. Then in the middle it's got a fountain. Alright. That is a fairly unique one. This one. All right, got it. Second picture. Okay, so second one at the top is a king dude. So he's got a big crown, he's got gray hair, and he's got like a little beard, like a goatee beard and mustache, a little bit like um, Tony Stark's. All right. Again, he seems to be wearing grey armour with golden motifs on it. And he's got a necklace with white beads and a golden cross with a red um, jewel in the centre of it. So that is hopefully this one. Alright, what's the tragedy? Uh, the tragedy is... It looks like a cat man. He's wearing lots of armor, he's got a bow, and he's been shot in the chest with three arrows. He's got peacocks on his um, shoulder pad and winged helmet. Alright, that would be this one. Alright, and the uh, accent? Uh, so that is... It's got a, like, a yellow golden background, it's got axes and sword and shield on the bottom and like uh tree branches on the side but not much leaves on them all right and uh third picture the man uh third picture is the night dude from the first one but he's facing the opposite way and he's wearing gold armor other than that, he looks pretty much exactly the same. Alright, and the tragedy? 
Tragedy is a woman with blonde hair and looks like she's got flowers or something in her hair as well. Uh, she's wearing a green and white dress, uh, a white necklace, red ring on her left finger, and she's been shot through the chest with an arrow. All right, and the accent. Uh, the accent is uh, trees on the side again, but they've got white leaves, and then there's four trees in the bottom again with white leaves. I think this one. Fight for the king. Destroy the enemies. 